Yo, 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 yo. <laughs> welcome, sorry. welcome, welcome, welcome. Hey. To what the streets have been asking for. Hey. To what the streets need. Come on. It's the streets news, the streets place. It's your boy RMJ. Hey. And to the right of me, I have. I'm joking, is that my intro? No, I, I don't know. It's been, going, it's going, been, going, it's been a year, man, but you know who it is? It's your boy, Mr. <laughs> Only One, one guy. guy. Mr. Mr. Arm So nah, Fly. Who got changed oh, that? Change it, change it. Best dreads on YouTube, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Only one guy. What out here? It's Rico. And guys, we're back with For the Streets. For the we Streets, man. We know you've been missing us. We know you've been needing us. It mm. is what it is. But as you can see, it's only me and Rico on this side. Mm. But on the other side, we've got two beautiful, talented, amazing, business minded women. Delicia and Tavana. Let's give a little round of applause for the girls. Let's give a round of applause for the girls. All right, this is the new cast of 4TS, so make sure you stay tuned and always check in with 4TS. Girls, introduce yourself, do your thing. Hello, hello. My name is Tavana. How are you all doing? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Good, man. Go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's it, man. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm Delicia. Mm -hmm. You could call me Della. Mm -hmm. Delicious. Mm -hmm. Delightful. Mm -hmm. Period, mm -hmm. yeah. Like, yeah. Well, I like that one Fun fact, my name actually means delicious in Portuguese. Mm. Oh. And a delicioso. No, so. so who influenced the name? Like, well, yeah. it, it, it's Spanish. It's supposed to mean delightful, but I like I like to mention the Portuguese meaning because it's a bit sexier, more grown. So that's your riz when you're moving to my Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, like, yeah, 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 my name means delicious in Portuguese. Uh, but obviously, because obviously that our, our fan base, they already know who we are. You know what I mean? They might not know who you two are in it. So just like, obviously tell them like what you're saying, innit? Mm. Tell them. Plug yourself, do your thing. Not oh, plug it, but yeah, obviously but, for yeah, the streets. Yeah, but, yeah. For the streets <laughs> <laughs> um, so you may see me on a few shows with um, Nella Rose, um, Comedy Central, I'm on a show. I have my own TikTok page that's oh. doing really well. I do a lot of reviews and I do a lot of presenting as well. Wow. So yeah, I'm out here, man. Big T. Yeah, man. D. Um, I'm an entrepreneur. Oh. <laughs> and I do eyelashes. Oh. Do I do anything? What's else? the name? Of, what's your name? Of your business? By Delicia. Oh, okay, mm. girls. If you need your lashes done, mm -hmm. need to look fleeky for a little date. You know mm -hmm. where to go. Yes, yes, and I do makeup. Oh, okay. Mm. So that's so I can send a couple. Like if I go yeah. out, little little rackass. Yeah. Rakas is, is in like North London. Oh, it's a, nice, it? it's oh, a, it's nice a restaurant. restaurant. Yeah, oh, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, little sushi samba. I can send them to you beforehand. Yeah. So, oh, you're taking a babe to. Yeah, yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm yeah. sending them to Lisa. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Exactly. Yeah, okay. exactly. Boom. Boom. Right. you up, you're going to look amazing. Oh, okay, okay, okay. On a Rakas strength. Yeah, man. But yeah, man, this is the new This is the new for the streets. Mm. Um, cast guys, so get used to us. We're back on your got the new logo. Make sure you see that you know as well. Mean, we're we're all there, huh? YouTube, Spotify, Apple, Apple Podcasts, Amazon. Check the TikTok page, Twitter, everything. We're there, we're Everywhere. there. Uh, so guys, 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 how how's everyone's weekend been? Obviously, it's been a bit of a long weekend. Just started. <laughs> do you know what? I, for, I forgot we used to do this on Sunday. <laughs> yeah. Sunday. How's everyone's week been? I've had a hard <laughs> week at work, right. I'll be real. Yeah, it's doing cool. an 8 a.m. shift, so. Life's, life's all right. This week's been okay. Mm. Um, just grinding. Mm. You know what I mean? I'm happy to be here. Mm. You know, get the grind moving and starting. Yeah. Yeah, man. I think what, because obviously we had a male dominated cast before, they'll probably want to know you guys' relationship status. Obviously, don't want to know if you're like, available, ah. if they can slide in the DMs or not. You know what I mean? So, I mean, if um, D, if you want to go first, what single on the streets, off the streets? See, like if if someone asks me, like, are you in a relationship? I say mm. something like that. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> or if they you. say, are you single? I say something like that. Like it's just something like that, isn't it? Like, Do you know what that means to me? If you said something like that, it means I'm taken, but rise me. Like still come mm. for me. Do you know what I mean? Mm. Like try it. Mm. And that's what I'm trying to say though. Mm. No, I'm not. I'm, but I you get no, no, no. That sounds no. That sounds so <laughs> bad. That sounds so bad. I'm not taken. Yeah, I'd say I'm occupied. But <laughs> if you're a real <laughs> nigga, you might be able to just snatch me up. Yeah, real real nigga. Real nigga. You ain't got shoulders. You ain't got shoulders. <laughs> I don't even know. What people Basically. just say real nigga. So it's a real nigga can come and snatch you up. Yeah, only a real one, not a fake one, not a, not nothing else, just a real one. Are you with a real nigga now? Yeah. 
Oh. Wait, you're with... <laughs> Wait, I'm so confused. So you're with a real nigga, but a real a, nigga. Yeah. yeah, a real nigga has to come along. A real nigga. Say so he's real, but you've got to be real. I don't know. I don't know. He's so... already real. you got to be real. Oh, he's already real. you got to be real. Yeah, yeah man, That's actually okay. a quote. Okay, T. Single. Straight. Mm, nothing. Straight, straight, single. No hezzy. No dating system right now? No dating system. I'm focused on me, living my best life. Independent black woman. Independent black woman. Honestly, Respect. That's, honestly, that's what I push for, man. Independent black woman. Yeah, baby. Genuine, honestly, I don't know. <laughs> what does that I mean? <laughs> <laughs> I bet you do. Yeah, we love independent yeah. black women on the street. On their ground. So on their ground, <laughs> yeah. But uh, you like the independent way, you don't really reply mm. to man them like. Yeah, so even if a man comes and chats to me and just... So it takes a couple of days to, for him to get a response so on like I message on him. I'll tell him as soon as he tries to move to me that I'm not interested. I'm genuinely like... It takes a real nigga, like she said, yeah. maybe like a real honk, a like, <laughs> yeah, maybe have to beep out the word, but yeah, real, realer than real, like mm. real, like you could never come and say anything to me if my man will be right, that, that kind of real, like. Okay, so mm. 2024, it's all about real real men. Let's real use this. Men. Real, men. real men. Real men. Real men. Not funny guys, <laughs> not attractive guys, not, not, not athletes, it's just real men. Real men. Okay. Real what? men that chop wood. Whoa. Huh? No chop diddy. wood. You know how you pulled. What? Chop wood. No, no diddy. Not chop no, that wood. wood. Nah, you better chop me, not chop no wood. <laughs> no, I need him to be out in the jungle. <laughs> oh, that's what you mean. Yeah. Oh, so you want him on crazy. his grind. Like, on okay, his grind. Okay. African men ain't really that. Like, we ain't really, obviously, unless you weren't Jamaicans and that, but... Here he goes. What does that mean? Here he goes. You know, no, you you know what I love this? You know I love this? He's the only, like, the only he's the only standing. African now. Before, I, I, was, I was on my own. <laughs> so now it's only him still. African, we ain't really chopping... Dropping but he ain't even real aff like that. Like, but who you talking about? He's talking about me. Oh, think... him. Yeah, yeah his thing, he what think you like one day yeah, Brazilian. Yeah, like, you're not even aff <laughs> like that. Though. Aff, I'm aff, Where are you from? <laughs> <laughs> he don't put out that much info. I'm real. Yeah, <laughs> Where are you from? From Africa. So. Where in Africa? <laughs> Listen, it's no. not one. No, of, it's no, it's not a Nigeria no. or Ghana. No, Where is no. It? Oh, yeah, <laughs> less Sierra Leone. He's not. He's not any of the main ones. Have I'm like basically, you know. What's that word when you like? like what are you? <laughs> Just say what you are. They're tapping me like I know. So, what's that word when you don't know where someone's from? Prom- it's not not promiscuous. We... You don't know where you're from. Ambiguous. Ambiguous. I'm a no, ambiguous say black. the country. No, I know, but I'm just saying I'm an ambiguous black. Right, like, cool. From? Basically, okay, look, 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 can I answer him? If it's like around carnival time, he's Caribbean, right? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I'm from if Cameroon, it, though. I'm from Cameroon. Yeah. Oh, okay. yeah. I'm from Cameroon. Okay. Cameroonians, you know. Well, they but no shame. Recent discoveries. You're also Congolese. So yeah, so he's, he's going to say that can, as well. Can you? Yeah, girl. Can you? I teach him. Oh, so RMJ when he's out, he does it. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> nah, dude, he's got a compilation of me dancing to Afrobeats. So, <laughs> yeah, um, Jamaican Afro on Afro Afrobeats. Beats part 100. And... Are you answering the state relationship state question? Or? I was about to ask you, but I'm like, I don't know, because obviously last so time... So let's continue with that. <laughs> <laughs> no, answer. Last, answer time, last time, obviously, What's your was relationship recording. status? So just if the obviously the people want to know, I don't, I don't know. Handsome man, you like, don't know. Girls need to know. Don't gas me. <laughs> yeah, let them know. Like, you up for the girls and that. Like. I didn't even get a trim. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, nah, I'm single, man. I'm single. Dating system isn't. I don't know. It's a bit up and shaky. Went on a dog walk the other day with like a another person with a dog. So Ooh. I'm trying that. This year I don't feed women no more. Uh, I don't feed women. That's why? my that's what? my that's my twenty twenty. Why? Fo- Remember, this fe- is gonna be recorded. Yeah, no, I don't feed women on dates though. That's a red flag. Like I can cook for you, but we can do everything fun until you're my missus. Miss, like when you're my missus, What's then I'll fun, feed you. What's fun though? Yeah, exactly. Escape Look. room, golf. Escape. But the thing, I make everything fun already as it is. Mm. I feel like if you've got a natural vibe, you already make it fun. Okay. You can't use everything else to make it fun. Do you get what I'm saying? Okay. If you don't get what I'm saying, it's fine. We'll go on a date one saying. day and we can chop How out. was the dog walk? No, amazing still. Obviously, Ooh. my hay fever was like... Playing up. Playing up. Oh, but then she's like, oh, you're, oh, yeah, she was like, oh, you're cheering up because you're going to miss me. And I was, it was a bit of riz, you know what I mean? But you just got to have that aura. So yeah, it was good. It was good. And the dogs were getting along. Obviously, my dog's a girl. Hers was a boy. Oh, okay. They were trying wow. it. Her dog were was, they? Yeah, yeah. Those, he was trying it. He was trying it, innit? Oh, yeah, my dog's a bit bougie. She don't just let any nigga pat pat. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, cool. um, Is there going to be a second one? What, a second dog walk? Yeah. If you see it on my story, you see it on my story. Do you know what I mean? Like, oh, God. Okay. You know, okay. Okay. Why, um, is she black? What, the dog? No. Nah. Dude. <laughs> 
Nah, I'm just saying, I've never had a black um, girl. Yeah, she had black in her, yeah. Oh, okay. She had black in her, <laughs> so, like, is that quarter? No, she's, like, mixed. She's mixed? Yeah. I don't believe you. Why? What? Why what? do you look so unsure? You're like... Well, no, she's, she's mixed. mixed. Okay. Okay. No, okay. she's mixed, so. Okay. Is, that, is that a problem? No, not at all. Uh, not okay. for me. No, I don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't have, like, a racial type. I just kind of like what I like. So what's your, like, pre... What, 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 what have you dated before? Is it... Just be able to cook chicken wings. Garrow, <laughs> no, you genuinely. have to tell me, like, from your knowledge, like, what colour are all of them? I don't have a colour type, honestly. Nah, genuinely. No. All right, so, so, two relationships ago, okay. it was, like, a, a brown skin, Jamaica, fully Jamaican babe. Okay. Then we went to still Jamaican babe, but light skin. Okay. Then I've just been dating around still, like, different flavours. Different, different spectrums different, still. Like, if, you, if, if, you, if, you, if you're yeah. Asian... Okay. <laughs> do you know what? Actually, this might sound crazy. Not try, but I actually want to try find like a connection with like a Filipino babes. Oh, like, I've never, I've never really strange. spoken to a fi- Filipino babe before, so I want to just. Oh, no. I mean, young yeah. Filipino. <laughs> Go on, so Rico, what's your relationship? Now, obviously, I'm single. You have a bunny hopper. Wait, what? Wait, what? Oh. That sounds like a Diddy what as well. <laughs> <laughs> what's a bunny hopper? I don't know. <laughs> you don't know what a snow bunny is, that? Oh, like, oh, snow, oh, oh bunny. snow bunny. Oh, yeah, I said it wrong. Bunny hopper. <laughs> I'm no, thinking, a bunny I'm hopper th- is a real thing where you hop from bunny to bunny, snow bunnies. You nah, just nah, like nah. snow bunnies. Or the Albert I, Slosh. I, <laughs> <laughs> you don't talk about that. I've never, I've actually is, never dated. I've never dated. It doesn't it. <laughs> but um, obviously, we love everyone. But yeah, I'm single, but I'm in love. Okay. Oh. With well, who? How many women? Hmm? Oh, he said, how many women? Joking, how many women? Okay, no, you're joking, you're joking. <laughs> With who? I obviously can't say any names, but oh, so you're single, and you're not together. How long? How long have you? So wait, wait, wait. Oh, oh, but what's that? What's wrong with that? Yeah, no, you're in love, in love you? but you're single, so it's like there's a bit of rift. yeah, there's like stuff. You know? A bit of what rift did you say? Yeah, yeah, yeah there's like just stuff in the in the middle, in it. So I mean, and how are you gonna come back together? Honestly, only oh, God, only God can lead the way. Yeah. Only God. Yeah, yeah, only God. Obviously, I pray every day, and obviously, you pray. You pray every day, okay? So, are you making active choices in order to get it back together? No, I mean, it's never been broken up, but I'm just in love. Okay. okay. Right. London men. Where's my camera? <laughs> London men. Be wary. Okay. Cheers. Thank you. <laughs> are you in love, but not together? And you've never been together? I mean, that's not how it works, though. No, nah, how no, dare No, that's possible, you? though. Yeah, no, nah, well, that is not possible. <laughs> it's impossible. You're not in that's love. That's not how it works. You're you not in love. Of course I am. How are you telling me I'm not in love? Because why? Okay, you've never been together and you're in love with her. Yes. Okay. Wait, when you say, no, work. obviously I've been, what do you mean? What do you mean? It doesn't work. What do you how mean? are you in love right, so with someone sh- you've how, never been together? How, how have you it allowed be? it to get to that stage, but then you've never wifed her? You've never taken it to that level. If that's the woman you want to be with, be there's good. no background noises. You be with that woman. For me, that's love. For you, I don't know. Never. Have you ever dated or slept together? Obviously, I'm still <laughs> sex before marriage. Oh. I'm being, I'm being like, I'm oh, really. Down. <laughs> I'm actually celibate. I'm just like, no oh, sex. yay, we love that. Abstinence, abstinence. We're on a celibacy and abstinence yeah, journey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Amen. Yeah, yeah. I love good, that. Yeah, How's so, it going? You nice. relaxed yet? No, no, I'm good, man. I'm that's good. good. Yeah. How long would you? Like a year and a half now. Really? Year and a half. Yeah. I'm coming. Are you lying? No, 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 no. sorry, sorry, <laughs> just, just cool. sorry. Cool. You know, when I speak, RMJ just can't take me serious, but he knows. He's actually knows. No, he knows no, he's seriously, seriously, seriously. I'm, cu- I'm a year in September. Yeah, nice. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Great you can't month, be having anyone. Can't yeah, you can't just have anyone just run up in there, Like no. she said, you can't just have, have anyone chop wood. That. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you can't chop wood. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I want to just jump in the song. Obviously, it's um, surfaced across media. Obviously, we we kind of make a make a, make a bit of a joke out of it using like no Diddy and that. But obviously, we've seen the clips. We've seen how it's been portrayed not even portrayed because it's actually terrible do you know what i mean obviously you look know a bit more about it than me i'm i'm gonna be honest i'm the worst person to come for to come to for like news and i don't really mm. so this is why i like this platform we can just fill each other in on what's going on mm. so p diddy p well, diddy cassie <coughs> bit of domestics what's his real name again Sean, Sean, Combs. Sean, Combs. Sean Combs. Yeah, yeah. Him no P. Diddy. Um, so there's a yeah. recent clip of him coming out the hotel room. It was from 2016, right? Yeah. 2016. I don't know why it only surfaced now. I mean, they should have let that shit out then. I, mean, re- I don't know if you have the information on what. So the reason as to why is because apparently, allegedly, mm. that he paid the hotel 50k to not say anything, and then those files that you know when they raided his house that yeah. time. 
that was um, obtained. And that's Wait, so he he kept the file. We paid and then kept the files. Yeah, yeah. Oh. And it was in one of it, they the FBI took it, but because it was from 2016, mm. they said because of the timeline, like the police did a report. Because of the timeline, they're not gonna. They can't prosecute. They, yeah, they can't. Oh, they're not, so they're not going to use that as evidence. No, or but then one thing I have seen circulate on social media is that he and Kanye West have said it that he is a plant. Not is it a plant or he is, is an FBI asset? FBI asset. asset. So Who, I feel P. like yeah, 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 he's an FBI asset. He's a big boy snitch. So because of that, that's why they're protecting him. Because I don't understand all the things that he's done. He has he even seen a cell. I don't think oh, I don't think he has. So. Yeah. Nah, just but... just before we dive in, just the full clip entails him running out of the hotel room in mm. a white towel. One well, she, hand on the towel. One hand on the towel is crazy. One, hand, one on hand, hand on the towel. On the towel. Someone, and was still someone said able... to me like, "That's how you know like he's been proper on this yeah. because to hold a towel and run down the and run down like I find it hard to be on my phone and yeah. eat at the same time. Yeah. Towel and what was he using left hand. I have no uh-huh. idea. Word, deep it. <laughs> no, he I... ain't letting his piece fall out, but he's gonna make <laughs> sure that he catches they didn't, her. Yeah, making to deal sure. With her. Remember, he dashed her one. Disgusting. Picked up something by the elevator. The towel didn't slip and, once. Yeah, and so then, he picked up. What was she trying her, to do? Escape. So she was yeah. trying to escape when he was asleep. So obviously she's got her stuff and she's moving. I can't like. I can't. Oh, that's the best yeah. time to run from a man. Um, who's naked, and so then he God. obviously <laughs> <laughs> clearly not good enough. But he like. He kept Due to the like WWE, yeah, Randy he, Orton. He, he sensed um, that she went there and he went and grabbed her in it. Sensed did... that she wasn't there? Obviously, because yeah, he, he was asleep, so he must have certain... woke up and then now and she's then gone and then he's yeah. ran out to go and chase her and do whatever. He's disgusting. But yeah, now Sean P. Diddy Combs, you're done. I mean, let's obviously... Is he though? Nah, he's done, he's done. Nah, in, in in the culture anyway, mm. yeah, definitely. he won't be accepted no ever. I, guess, so. I just don't understand. You see how R. Kelly... Um, is now in prison for what he's done. Yeah. Why ain't P D the same? I feel but like his time is coming. Um, honestly, the oh, the Peter yeah, but I yeah, bet yeah. you any money, his time will come with something not related to no, women but violence. R Kelly's thing was different because he actually those videos of him. There's so many testimonies of him pissing on kids and okay. Aaliyah. There was too many yeah. um, different situations where he got away with, and then they had to get him in it. Plus the documentary. So and that was that's what that, over 15 years for R Kelly to go in prison. Yeah. So it will take at least an hour. No, I feel like obviously this social media is a bit more there in it, so it'll probably yeah. happen quicker. But mm. we have got social but media police now; they'll do their own investigation mm. of things. Yeah, and he was still R. Kelly was still getting co-signed by certain people in it because it was still a bit hidden. But now everyone's seen this video. P. Did he's finished? Yeah. I hope yeah. so. You're done. He's got how many <laughs> girls? He's got how many kids? And yeah, that's yeah. how he's treating women. But, do you know I found out the other day he, what he took? His son's gal off him or something like that, innit? Um, and Laurie Harvey, innit? See, that's this it, is that's what, it, yeah, that's what it was, yeah. Laurie Harvey's you got, you actually got to think, anyways. that's a bit... She's, yeah. she's, Laurie she's, Harvey she's, said she didn't me. date, did he? Where? Oh, you know, she came out and said, from. like, I just want to clear the... I think she was on a podcast and she said, like, I want to clear the air. Like, I've never... Oh, she never dated with him. his dad. Like, I, I don't know why people keep saying that. And that's when she was going out with Damson. I think he forced her to kind of say, like, you better clear the air, like, yeah, don't yeah, ruin yeah, my yeah. name. Rep- ruin my name yeah. on the ends, like, the man them on me. They're saying you like dads and that, yeah. Obviously, <laughs> on a more, like, personal thing, like, how does that make you look feel, obviously, knowing that, like, there's guys like this just still trying to, you know, still out here <laughs> doing their thing? I think it's disgusting. Like, mm. It's so vile. And when, initially, when Cassie... Started her case and that every like a lot of people are saying. Beautiful. Can I just say sorry? Yeah, Cassie's so beautiful. Now she's over white guy. You know what's crazy? You know what? <laughs> I'm good. I'm good. No, but but I'm you not, know what? I'm gonna I'm have to ha- be the one to that. say it. Yeah, I'm here for that. Though. She is with a white man. A lot of black women. <laughs> are now, what? You, listen, I'm we joking. can go before the streets joking, today. You know, <laughs> I swear to you, we can really start the case. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. Anyway, she is with a white man and he's treating her so very well. So what do you have to say with your with your people them doing the same thing? Wait, what? What? Putting hands on women. What oh, are you gonna no, say? No, no. But PD is Jamaican. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's not. No, he's American. Yeah, no. I don't think PD is Jamaican. No, I think no, he no. was Somali. I promise. I promise. Sean Combs. That's not an African. No, no that's, that's American. American. He's African American. Huh? No, there's African American. African American. I found that's out. Not a, thing, a lot of African Americans. Yes. They don't know where they're from. They're I know. I know. He's I know. Somali. I don't so care. you just made it up and you, you said that he's Jamaican because what? No, he just he just hates Combs. Google no, it. Obviously, he's African American. Remember, you, where are you from in Jamaica? 
Don't no, don't ask me. Because he's not from there. He's where not are you from, from Where are you from in Jamaica? He's, he's not, not from there either. Are you not Jamaican? I'm not Jamaican. <laughs> where are you from? Antigua and Barbados get to know. Oh, she's oh. a real yeah. 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 Yes. Where are you from, bro? I'm from Jamaica. No, where, where, where? Sean ain't from there. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what Sean is. I don't know everywhere in Jamaica. Well, anyways, it's got I'm nothing from to do with the country yeah true it's what well, everything to do with how you've been brought up it's no, been everything course, to do with what you've seen as a child in your childhood trauma but sometimes people allow money fame and wealth to get to their head and that's exactly what he did mm -hmm. he's been abusing women he's been abusing artists for a very very long time there's an um artist called there was this whole group have you heard of it called danny e. kane yeah yeah, 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 yeah he was that a girl group that was a girl group okay. and he did them dirty there was one member what was her name again she was even on big brother um, if we could put her picture up or something like yeah, that, but, yeah, yeah. or her name there. Um, she was speaking out on him for time mm. about how abusive he is and how controlling he is. Mm. He's a nasty piece of work. And one thing that irritates me is that there's so many men within this industry that think that they can do that. Mm. And you know what? Sometimes I'm an advocate. If he's putting his hands on you, bang him back mm. because I'm sorry. I don't know who men will put their men. Okay, cool. Breathe. Men choose their victims very wisely. Yeah. yeah? They know that. Or, and you know that. Like they know saying, who they can manipulate. They just know by who reading they can you. manipulate. And one thing that is really beautiful is if you're dealing with a man and he just rejects you out of nowhere, blah, blah, blah. Always see that rejection is projection. I mean, rejection is protection. Mm. Because more time, they're just here to try and bring you down, especially if you're a sh like a woman that's got a lot going for yourself. Yeah. They will see that and want to bring you down and bring mm. you down and bring you down. Nah, if a man tries to put his hands on you, Perfect. bang him again. Even if you don't know how to ball a fist, slap him hard, yeah. rip his face. Let him know that he cannot mess with you. Yeah. He may try it again, but that's for you to pick your stuff up and go because yeah. he has no self-esteem. He's a weak ass man. Let a man come and thump him in his Bumble. face. He ain't gonna do nothing. Mm. Men like him make me sick to my core. Yeah. And Sean, I'm not calling him Puff Daddy was it brother love is that his name he yeah. tried yeah. he tried rebranding into brother love it's okay <laughs> when it happens when another man comes in his face because it will happen boom it's finished yeah, it's yeah, finished it's disgusting yeah my thing is when like i was saying cassie when she first came out there were people on twitter saying like mm -hmm. basically she's lying she's mm -hmm. chatting shit like no how more. can this is why people don't come forward because you're saying all of this stuff you don't know you would think that Diddy's their homeboy. Mm. Mm. You don't know this man from nowhere. Yeah. Mm. And it's always hard, you know, trying to bring a black man down. Like I've got proof and on it's, my it's TikTok, weird actually. There was like the speculation speculations of him being a bit fruity. fruity, fruity. Because yeah. like there was even a clip of him and Mike Tyson on the same. Yeah, and he had to move couch, out of the way. And he's touching them up on the oh, leg and then to yeah. so then switch to this side. It's just a bit all misunderstood about who this guy actually really is. Mm. I'm not sure if he even knows. And then, like, pointing them back to Tavana's bit, um, there was two things I wanted to say. There was a movie that I'd seen, yeah? It's about, base. I forgot what the name of the movie is. It's even from, like, 2016 or even further, where this guy is, um, I don't know if they've broken up, but they still live in the same household, right? And he's abusing his woman, abusing his woman. And then one day, she just says, nah, fuck this. Like, I think she starts going to taekwondo or some sort Woods. of, like, training. Kicking and she, she learns how to use her surroundings. Period. Yeah, so one day he comes back home from work. I think there's a whole three-week compilation of her training, um, just getting her strength and, like, defense mechanisms up. And then, like, he comes back from home and he tries it on her. And she uses the whole... Ha that, like, I think it was a whole evening and night, like, from, like, 8 p.m. to, like, 4 a.m., where she's defending herself, defending herself, defending herself. I'll try and get the name of the movie. And she punches him up and then she's like, she got that satisfaction of freedom. Do you know what mm. I mean? And I was like, oh, that was really big of her still. Mm. So I've got literally yeah. even here, look at, I've made a video on TikTok and a man says to me, I don't know if the camera can pick it up. He goes, wow, poor you. Hope you've got a good attorney. Judging someone by the media, propaganda is very easy. What was this video? What, what, sorry, what's this was, video when about? I was, this video is literally about when I was talking about P. Diddy when everything came out when they raided his house. Oh, you house. made a video about it? Oh, yeah, okay, okay. on TikTok. Oh, okay, and then yeah. all the stupid misogynistic men that just think, oh, yeah. it's the media just want to bring a black man down. Man, shut up, man. Yeah. Abuse is abuse. It's really got nothing to do with race. So, yeah. I, don't, yeah, I don't think it has anything to do with race. No, it's all got nothing. nothing to do with race. We're talking about abuse as well, yeah. Staying on the P. Diddy thing. Obviously, I'm not sure if everyone's watched Baby Reindeer. 
Yeah. Everyone watched yeah. me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I loved it. Mm. Yeah, so I, I loved it. I was traumatized still. Traumatized. Oh. Yeah. I was scared for my you, life. Yeah, you needed to be traumatized. No, but I was scared the woman was actually scary. You know? Yeah, like, you needed <laughs> that. You, know what? you needed no, no. I feel like the I like when, actually... do you know, like, on TikTok, a lot of people are saying, like, why would they put this out? Like, I couldn't even get past episode two. But I feel like, everyone needs to be exposed mm. to certain things yeah, so they can understand life because a lot of people won't even know that side of life ever yeah. had it not been a show on Netflix. I said mm. this before, life is be some, side, obliv- some, it's not, like some it's side not. of roses still. It's not, it's not at all. And I really, um, I really feel sorry for him and I hope he gets better because trauma really affects everything that mm. you do in your life moving mm. forward sure. from the point of trauma. Mm. Yeah. And yeah, I feel like it was really healthy to put it on Netflix. You know what, right? Even though like we're all saying about Martha, but this is what just irritates me. Why is no one Talking wondering where guy. the man is? Like, yeah, that, no, that, for me, the man, where is is the man. man. Do you know that was the hardest thing for me to watch? I, yeah. I couldn't watch it. Yeah. I had to pause it. His abuse and I was angry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was really angry. The man angry. had more of an impact. The on man had more yeah. of an impact. Yeah. The guy if it and wasn't, it. For, mm-hmm. sorry, if it wasn't for him, this wouldn't have come about. Yeah, really, yeah, truly. yeah But everyone's now focusing oh, on Mar- Martha, Martha because she was obviously really obsessive. And yeah, yeah, okay, she's got her own problems, but we need to focus on the man. But you yeah. know, they tried to find them. So basically, I think um, what's it? What's the director's Rich, name? The guy that um, the writer Dad. Richard Gadd. Yeah. So he came out on socials because uh, obviously they found Martha before she even went on the Piers Morgan mm. thing. Um, but they were saying um, they were trying to find the guy in it because they were checking Richard. Mm. They were checking his track records of yeah. who he's worked for and going into the business and trying to find yeah, everyone people, that's worked there mm. through that time and then trying to put names and that and trying to find who people the guy is. Richard came out and said, oh, guys, please stop doing this. Yeah. This is obviously him. This whole this whole series is him like kind of just coming out and just mm. trying to like let the thing done. Mm. So he, he didn't want people ch- trying to go, like, go out of their way and find extra ways to just but he needs to be thing. found because he's got some terrible drugs up in that drawer of his <laughs> yeah, and drugs. I feel like that was just I, that was too much for me to take in I really had to pause that mm. I didn't even feel it the thing that's great with that show is that I you know they say our oh, men need to speak up more and everything yeah. like that it made me look at myself because I thought like, oh, if a man's going to speak up, a man's a man, like you guys are going to be heard. It was very shocking to see that the police weren't yeah. taking him seriously yeah, whatsoever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It would re- it really threw me off and it made me think, well, why don't you just leave? And you, those are the questions that you ask. Like, loads of people are going to ask Cassie, why don't you leave? Why don't you leave? But it's, mm, you it's can't hard, leave. It? Yeah, Not that Sometimes you can't leave, but... but... Did he, in the pod, in the... In the series did he ever go to the police about what that man did to but him? You, no, yeah, no he never he did that like, he, he went I think if for you, the woman if yeah. you listen to the episode yeah, though, he, he didn't want to go to the police and say what Martha did without exposing the guy he says it yeah, he yeah. but he did that. in the end he just did speak about Martha and not the guy I don't no, even he think d- no he spoke on the stage okay. and people tied it all together but oh. when he went to the police he never brought up the, the guy that worked for the yeah, exactly. producing company Why? or anything Disgusting. It's, he explains it's it all. Abuse. I'm not Richard, so but that's why. Like, even so, when she in the show, she went to jail in it, but she, she didn't, didn't go. She to didn't jail. actually go to jail in real life. They said that that was fake. Um, but yeah, the reason even in real life he didn't say nothing is because he didn't want to expose her. If he mm. felt like he was exposing her, he, and he didn't expose the guy, that like, he's two wrongs. Don't well, she's right come out. Or, or he free. needs to also come out, or some. He needs to get locked up. And There's I, a free man roaming needs... the street. Yeah. Yeah. Do you know what it shows about this world? Yeah, it's that mm-hmm. some crimes are actually gonna go unsolved, and some yeah. some people, some bad people in this world, are just gonna go freely without like getting prosecuted. Or like that's just the world we live in. Unfortunately, like some like criminals it. aren't gonna end up in cells and. Yeah, not that we have to deal with it, but that's yeah. the sad reality of this world, and, and it yeah. you got to deal with it. So shows another level of manipulation as well. Obviously, mm-hmm. Richard wanted to just blow in it; he just wanted to make yeah. it as a writer. But yeah. my man said, "Yeah, writer." And my this dad. is what happens com- in this industry. It well. happens so much in this industry. It's just crazy. Men thinking that they can. Oh, I'm gonna make you a star. Yeah. Blah 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 blah. And then all of a sudden, they're asking you to come over to play fucking PlayStation. Piss off. <laughs> PlayStation's great. That's happened. So, I've oh, worked wait, with someone them. asked you to come play Listen, PlayStation? Listen, I was working with, you know what? Yes, that's, let me talk my things. Oh. I'm, I'm, what was it? I was working with this guy in a studio and it was going really well. I was recording a hit show um, and doing my reactions for it. Mm. And he ended up being very controlling, mm. very argumentative. I couldn't do anything wrong. If I do anything wrong, it warrants a friggin' 
hours on end argument. He would call me continuously. There was even a point where my mum had to pick up the phone. Well, you voice not me around this time, not oh. You may have known about it. I had to call my mum. Not many people shout me in the to beat me for a minute. So. <laughs> he, um, and then I then found out that he was also abusing other women as well. Like he was, and then he always used to be like, no, I'm going to make you this, I'm going to make you that. And then when I no longer wanted to work with him or whatever, he wanted to try to teeth my ideas. He mm. wanted to try, and he tried to replace me how many times? It's such a notorious story. Tried to replace me so many times and it didn't bloody work. It wasn't doing the numbers. And I had to sit back and say, you know what, T? If it weren't for me, he would his company wouldn't have had done those numbers. Yeah. I did those numbers. Mm. You didn't do those numbers. All of the stuff that <coughs> I got myself on, like if it was TV or YouTube or whatever, I did that through hard graft. What I've done on my platform, I did that. But the thing that they do is they make it seem like they've done it. They make it seem like, oh, if it wasn't for me, you wouldn't be here. You wouldn't yeah. be there. Mm. No, you really need to take a step back. See, look yourself in the mirror and see who you are as a person. See, no, 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 I did that. They ain't got no control over nothing. They're little, mini school, immature men. Yeah. No, boys that think that they have... I don't know. I'm really passionate about this. Actually. No, 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 for sure. Do no, this is why we put women on the pod, man. Yeah. yeah. I I'm couldn't just, do this. I, uh, but <laughs> this is just the reality of it. So what we're seeing with the whole Richard Gadd, what we're seeing with P. Sean Combs, yeah. is that his actual government? I want his full government African name. Somewhere on Google. So. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> his African name is crazy. No, the f I want the fullness Wait, of to it. To do what with it, though? To address him. As who he is when he was born on the birth certificate. Well, do you know what I've realised, yeah? Can I just... I just want to... On that Go point, on. yeah? These... This guy, this... Like, he knows how big of a... What do you call it? A star? A celebrity he is. He knows he's in the public eye. Mm. you got to realise there's a certain point when a man just don't care. Like, oh, us in, over here in the UK, people all the way in Scotland, Ireland, wherever, he's thinking, I couldn't care less. Because he's doing this madness. He's doing stuff... Yeah, who are you talking about? Sean, Sean, Sean Love Combs, that's his name. Sean Love Combs, yeah. yeah. Sean, On Google. Wait, so wait, yeah. he bought the name. Wikipedia. Love. No, his name is Wikipedia. Sean, Sean Love Combs. <laughs> Sorry. Sean Wikipedia. Love Combs couldn't give a. He couldn't care because to do all of this stuff, be out in the limelight, do it to somebody who else is in the limelight. What's Cassie, a model and host, and mm. right. So yeah. to do stuff to also someone that's in the limelight, you gotta realize there's a lack of care. That I saw, that this man has they don't to just have keep on um, doing it. Do you know what I'm saying? A conscience. Mm. They lack mm. about conscience. Yeah. How. In these situations, how long it has to go on for before someone says something. Mm. Because even on Baby Reindeer, he kept linking that man again and again yeah, yeah, and again yeah. and again. Cassie kept linking that man that. again and again no, and again true. and again. Oh. She even made a song, said, I'm tired of being just hair like I want to be your official girlfriend because she was never they were what never official called? official girl it was literally called never. She, yeah she had someone in the music before. video pretending to be Diddy like uh, to basically say like this song's for you make me your girl if you want to be my right. official girl let me know. I was gonna say that <laughs> but <laughs> it's just like it's Stockholm syndrome like your abuser you just feel so attached to your abuser right. and like it's so crazy wanna... how these two things are kind of well tied together yeah. well, well tied but oh, like, no, they have like kind of similarities yeah. 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 yeah I'm a leave yeah I'm a leave even up. even I just want to touch on the fact that like obviously obviously I know how this can touch both of you but like me I have like younger like a younger sister mm. most of my like like main connections in my family are women, my nans, my grand, my not my nans, my grands, my nans, my aunties. I'm close to my mom. I'm closest to like my younger cousins. All, on my dad's side, all my cousins are younger than me, and most of my female. So to know that they're gonna grow up in a place where men can be manipulative, can and that some of them want to be creative as well, and they might be in a space where a man might try and take them into the into a wrong setting and treat them like that. Mm -hmm. I, that's why I look out for them. I try and shout mm -hmm. them as much as I can and. As, as well for man them that if if you love youngers or if you have a sister as well like look out for them because and also for yourselves yeah. as well like girls and man them yeah, yeah. yeah. man them like men call can Rico be first Rico call me we'll sort it out so yeah. like, man them the girls because like, I I see how he is he's got like a lot of sisters as well on his side so I know yeah. even though he's he's, he's <laughs> what's your friend nah, listen was that, was that was that was that a hidden secret <laughs> no no nah, everyone knows I got sisters <laughs> okay yeah like but even though he's youngest he's still pr very protective of them so. <laughs> But yeah, no, Gara, Gara. I don't know what to say that. <laughs> no, you know, I just didn't know what you was going to say. It's still, you're good. No, you never know what I'm going to say. I'll be honest. That's my thing. But it's true, like, as Mandem as well, I don't know, like, I don't know if RMJ would come to me. I'd be real, like, what's up to tell you, like, like, basically, the other day I was with. What is this? Tanisha. Wait, no, I want to I see what he's going to say. The other day I was with Tanisha, like, obviously I didn't want to clock, but 
Rose Martin. Huh? That's like lame, 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 lame. what happened to Richard Gadd, didn't it? Oh, okay, okay. All right. Do you know I mean, I don't know if RMJ will come and tell me that he basically like. Oh. Do you know what I mean? Okay. Wait, what? Like a girl, like basically. If a girl took if a, advantage if he was with a girl, you. that was horror role play. I'll be honest, but mm. go on. Yeah, it was. Was it bad? Yeah. yeah, yeah. It was so we're, bad. Look, we're, we'll work on it. We'll work on it. It's episode one. We'll work on it. I told you, like, he mumbles, but we'll get on it. <laughs> was that mumbling? Yeah. Yeah, yeah I, I thought you were trying to act as <laughs> like, like, me. I don't think I was, I was. I was. I was. I don't mumble. He like doesn't turn like that. Oh yeah, he's a bit more like. He says you're a cartoon character. <laughs> 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 no, nah, but I'm so saying like, somebody... if RMJ got like sexually assaulted, because yeah. that was what say happened. Say essay. Oh, is that mm-hmm. the, the yeah. that, that we breathe? Oh, it? Essay. Oh, yeah, because you have to. Yeah. Breathe it. If RMJ got essayed, I don't know if he'll come tell me like, yo, like this is what happened to me. I got essayed like, and it was I just don't know how to feel about it. And obviously, because RMJ. He's hench as well, so it makes him feel worse. Do you know what I mean? If it's me, I'm a bit, so I can do it. But someone like RMJ, these guys, I don't know. Do you, do you get what I'm saying? Though? <laughs> he basically, what? Let me let me put his People stuff please, in a nutshell. What if anything ever happens to you like that? Don't ever feel ashamed. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. That's what he's trying to say. Yeah. yeah. Your family, the yeah. police, tell even go on social media as well because you're no one's gonna look at you any differently. Yeah, no one's gonna look at you any differently. Definitely, no, no one. But at the same time, I think nah, with a lot of like not myself and me being whatever size, I think men don't want to put themselves in those situations where they have to let their pride down. Mm. And kind of because it did take a lot for Richard to kind of it took him on stage at his lowest point mm. to actually come out with that. Do you know what I'm saying? Mm. So a lot of guys in today's society where social media is a thing, where the thought that okay, if I let this story out. The girl who I probably like is going to see it and probably mm. look at me this way. Jobs are going to see it. Mm. Flipping, I don't know. My family's going to oh, see yeah. it and then look at me as, oh, the guy that got essayed. Do you mm. know what I mean? And you don't want that kind of, A lot of people don't want that kind of stigma on themselves. So mm. they'd, rather just, they'd rather just live with it and take it to their grave. Do you know what I mean? Mm. So they just kind of bury it under their own pillow. And I think mm. anyone that has to kind of bury their thing under their own pillow, like you kind of just live with that thing and let it traumatize you and... Fair enough, yeah, there's don't. a way to go about it, like eventually let it surface, but it's about finding that way, you know, yeah. finding that route to like let it surface. I'm a big advocate for therapy. Please get therapy. And those that, I even have family members that think, oh, what's a therapist going to do, blah, blah, blah. They just make it worse. No, they don't. Especially if you have a good therapist mm. um, and you have one that you can connect with. The goal of it is to take whatever's upset you or whatever trauma you have, they objectify it. They kind of make, they can't, no, they make sense of it and they remove it. It's literally like a puzzle and they just take a piece, piece by piece. Mm. And that's how you kind of find solace in that situation and it yeah. helps you to move forward. Oh. So never think, oh, I'm just telling somebody my business and blah, 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 nothing's going to happen. Everything is going to happen. You will be able to breathe differently. You'll be a lot lighter. A lot of things, will, a lot of stress will be off your shoulders simply because a therapist has taken taken a situation you've been through and been able to objectify it. And that's a, a key word for them to objectify it is major because then it's able. They're able to kind of remove it. Do you know what I mean? And yes, things can be expensive, and I don't. I wouldn't advise anyone to go through the NHS because obviously the NHS has, has its own problems and there's a major waiting list. Mm. But if you've got an extra fifty pounds, or if you feel like you shop somewhere where you can go and afford to shop somewhere cheaper, just so you can save for that fifty pounds to go do therapy, do it because it's an investment in yourself is an investment in your mental health, and you won't allow that other person to feel like that they've won somehow. And also know that you. What am I trying to say? You're better than them. That's who they are regardless. Whether it's you, whether it's the next person, that is who they are and it's in their core. So they're never going to change. No matter what you do, they're never going to change unless they go therapy and sort out their deep, deep trauma. But it's going to take years. By the grace of God, you will be able to just remove yourself from them, get your therapy, and I promise you, life will look a lot better but as for those demonic evil people, they will get what's coming to them. But don't sit there waiting for it. Go and sort yourself out. Mm. That's wow, what I that's, have to that say. was amazing. Oh, so. I don't even know what you I just said. <laughs> <but. It's laughs> that, was, that was amazing. No, yeah. I just quickly want to say: Do you also think believe that within like your circles or your family, do you think there's other better forms of like therapy that can assist through your circles? Yeah, through your circles. No, so, like, 
There's no. other, like Dan Dan going to a natural therapist or well I used to know it as shrink. I used to, I don't know why mm. I like that word, but for it to go into a shrink because they a shrink your situation. That's why. Oh, okay. Okay. They shrink oh, it yeah. till it's not there anymore. Wow. So I personally like, okay, you can go to your mum, your dad, yeah. or whatever. Because but those it's are not outlets that anything. you can use. Like, do you know what I mean? Like, for example, I've been through situations where I've gone to Recon and said, and we spoke about me and him are big on mental health. So we've kind of like spoken about a thing, not just through like one conversation, through like a whole week or a whole month. And slowly but surely, like, it's eradicated the situation. So you know there, are, there are times when you can go to like another outlet and it does cure the situation. Do you know what I'm saying? I do get what you're saying. And I'm, that is definitely an option. You can try that. You can do that. Mm. But personally, I okay, it depends on your situation. It depends yeah. on your trauma. If it's something as deep as what Cassie's gone through, I wouldn't advise to just rely on your friends and family. Oh, yeah, because course. remember, they mm, have their yeah, own yeah, lives yeah. and they have their own issues mm. and they can't be there for you 100% and that's just the way the cookie crumbles. But when it comes to a therapist, that is their job mm. and they're going to dedicate their time and their energy in order to shrink that situation and remove it. But if you're constantly trying to rely on family, personally, I don't think it's going to eradicate it at, like majorly. No, I don't mm. think so because... I've been in a situation and I've gone with friends and family. And even though, yeah, they've been there to hold me while I've cried, yeah. but the therapy got me through it and also God. So yeah, yeah I feel like that. God feel is a major, God is me. key. If you believe in a higher yeah. power and if you don't believe in a higher power, seek a higher power and you'll see. I won't say anything else. You'll just see. Yeah, 100%. I, me, for me, I don't feel like therapy really works for me. So seeking out God is also something that's really good to do. Like God will answer your prayers. God will listen to your problems and you'll feel a lot lighter in yourself. And he will take away any stigma or any wow. shame that you feel. He yeah. always will. If you don't even feel, if you don't feel comfortable to go to church yet, you pray at home and he will still talk to you. You don't have to be at church. Mm. Oh, this is, I'm, I'm so no, inspired. You don't have I'm to so be. inspired right now, genuinely. So sometimes God you say will hold you. you. Sound nah, but I know you're. I know I'm you're not being. Genuine, you sound I'm so inspired. Right? Uh, she even got a cross in her chest. Right? Genuine. Period. Why do you never I baptized. You were in yours, yeah. Mm -hmm. In February. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> Why do you know? You never I said that. that. I didn't hear my mind. But she, she, got, she got baptized. That. Oh no, I saw. No, I saw the clip. I saw the clip. Yeah, that's amazing. I want to get baptized. You know what's crazy is when I went through that whole moment. I knew before I was going to be. I knew years ago I was going to be baptized, and every time I used to just tell it was like a feeling in my head and I used to tell God like please I just want to enjoy a little piece more please 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 mm. but um yeah it was the maddest feeling um when you go under the water it's crazy how the water like just a little like, bit of a revelation like feeling it yeah. just felt like every it, I don't know the water even though the water the water just felt heavy yeah and then when I came up I felt like whoa I couldn't get to my feet mm, yeah. and then I just felt in everything just in I can't I can't tell you yeah, how, my feeling, life yeah. before I can tell you snippets of my life before baptism but I can't tell you all the things that I've been worried about up until then it's literally gone wow what kind of changes do you are you gonna like or have you already gone out of your way to make to to change um, during the from the time that you was before so baptized or now I would say celibacy has been one, but that's because just the state of the dating scene and everything mm. like that, I just don't want to. So we're going to talk about that next. Time, <laughs> but I, but I just feel like when this is, when you're, because I'm still new to this, so I don't want to like. New to what, dating? No, new to being born again. Okay, yeah, oh, yeah, 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 okay. still matters. Thank you. Yeah. Um, but it's more so of, how can I explain it? One thing I've struggled with being in this stage is the revelation of how evil this world is and the revelation of everything is spiritual and nothing really and truly, like anything that's happening to you, it's all spiritual. Yeah. There's the, the other side is very real. Yeah. And even with the negative thoughts, it's, it's the devil. It's yeah. the devil in so many ways. Mm -hmm. Even if someone's gone and um, killed someone, that's literally spirit. Like there's this person, like say if I go and kill you, right? Mm -hmm. I'm me in the flesh, 
but it's a spirit Sorry. behind me. This sounds so crazy, but it's, there's a possessed. spirit. There's a spirit somewhat okay. leading me to go and kill you because of all the force, all the negativity that you allow to overwhelm you. But then, say for instance, you put God into it, and you take these negative thoughts from me, remove the spirit of this, remove the spirit of that. Mm. You, it really is everything spiritual. And then, obviously, God will put His power. And it will remove the situation, but it really, everything's spiritual, everything. And yeah, that's no, something no. that I've been struggling. No, it's just scary. It's think... scary. But I've got God, so yeah. Oh, but no, it's good, the realness good. of the world. Mash up. No, it's crazy. It's crazy. I think like there's another, I think we can talk about that in depth in like another yeah. episode. But you want to talk about the day. No, no, no. no, 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 see, not, no and then I why know. the man them don't need no, no more yeah. I, don't, I, I just want to say something funny based <laughs> on the P. Diddy thing. Somebody tweeted, niggas asking what did Cassie do to trigger Diddy? Stay, I, love... I saw that as Stay well. Stay safe, Queens. Are you crazy? Stay safe, Queens? Are you crazy? Queens, Queens. Wait, like, it was a, So basically the tweet was from, I don't know what tweet the name is. Football pages. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It says, mm. niggas asking what did Cassie do to trigger Diddy? Stay safe, queens. Oh, okay. So he's trying to stick up for the women kind yeah, of thing. Yeah, be... yeah, no, but the thing she is, that's what it I mean, let's not get it wrong. Let's not get it wrong. I it's don't not, be, got I don't, nothing to do with I don't triggering. Be the bad You're guy. your own person. I don't want to be the bad guy. There oh, are some instances, away so from this instance here. And dumb, bro. Away from this instance here, there are some situations where women can... No, can, no, no, no. Not the no, abusive okay, thing. Not the, not the abuse situation, but more of the fallout like and fall out of relationship thing where women can do the triggering to kind of get under a guy's skin. What kind women of can be abusive, abusive what kind as well. Of triggering? Unless she put Your her dick hands is on weak. you. You're you, you ain't paying no, for shit. Like, no. So does that mean I should hit no, you? No, 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 wait, no, like, no. Can I land? No, you can't. <laughs> but your dick is weak. If your dick is weak, your dick is weak. I, I, I just started. I didn't even No, but to... it's the truth though. No, I'm saying to be, there's, a, there's, there's some things you can do to belittle a man that can make him outrage. No. I'm not saying, I'm saying away no. from this situation. No. Why are you so I can't, I, can't, I can't talk away from the situation. You can, but. Well, can I? I'm already, yes. But based off what you've just said, yeah. it doesn't matter what a woman says to you. You do not lift up your hand. No, no. I'm nothing. against. Remember, I'm against li okay. lifting okay. up my hand. Okay. Yo, You're just trying me. to play devil's advocate. Is okay. that a problem? Yes. All right, we can't do you, that. You now didn't make it clear before. It. I thought this was I thought, your opinion. I thought, I thought, I thought you could, could understand me and read me. Handsome man as I am, as you mentioned, you could understand where I'm coming from. I'm just checking. Go on. No, no, no. It's fine. I can't, I can't play devil's no, advocate. No, play you devil's advocate. You can. Play devil's I'm saying advocate. away from this situation, yeah, there are some instances. I'm, I'm not saying you two are, or there's, there's somewhere out there where a woman is belittling a man that can be outraging him to the point where he feels the urge to want to like do that, I'm not so saying you know he should. I'm do? not saying he should. No, I'm not saying. Yeah, look. But well, go on. what do, what would he do in that? What what's well, the way to go? get up? Mm -hmm. You put on your running trainers and you get your ass to the gym. You bit of Forrest Gump. You, know what? <laughs> you put on your running trainers. You put on your gear and you go to the <clears> gym. If <throat> you're angry to that sense, you don't put your raise your hand. You don't uh, even raise your voice. What? But you know, as people, I'm not go to the gym. Allow the woman to keep belittling you. Go to the gym and sort it out. Hey, that's no, crazy. you go. Uh, oh. I'm okay. just trying to understand. Are you ready? Are you ready? Go on. Because we can go. No, we can, I'm, I'm, okay, I've been let's going. Go. We've got 12 more minutes. We've got 12 more minutes. Let's go. So you're saying a woman can outrage a man to get to a point. A point of what? A point where he's angry enough to have that urge to do something, but he doesn't do it. So what's your point here? Okay, the urge... <sighs> He you can it, have the urge, it. but you just don't act on it. After them kind of questions, wraps me. Just <laughs> think about it. When you're when you're at work, your coworkers pissing you off. You're thinking, I could bang you in the face. And what do you do? You leave that job. You, you leave that job. You don't leave the job. You, you, you go calm the fuck down. I and you. Vape. <laughs> yeah, you have a vape and a red dot. Don't vape. Don't vape. Stop vaping. Stop vaping, please. Yeah, but some people you do vape, might have a vape and a red dot. Yeah. she vapes. All these... <laughs> Sorry, not like that. Not like that. Gara, she I just, no, I've seen her vaping. I've seen her vaping. But don't, don't you're, say you're Gara like that. Like that. But don't say Gara like that. Well, that's, like that's, a, that's, a, that's a recent development, oh, actually. Okay, very <laughs> recent <laughs> development. Very, very recent. So that's an e is on, eh? Like, and it's truly just out of boredom. It's out of boredom. Yeah, literally. Get your running trainers on. No, I go to the gym, like. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I have too much time on my hands sometimes. Like. You just, you, you have your own I two businesses, have... Rude Gang. Yes. How you got too much time on your hand? I'm and telling then you, you. And then you play games on Twitch. Exactly. So what are you talking about? But this is what I'm saying. You don't understand. You do not understand. I have all this free time. You got here. younger siblings? Yes, sir. So where is this? Cook. I clean, I play games. So he's asking, where's the free time? Where's the free time? It comes, like, it's there. Like, 
I'll do everything that I want to do in the day. I'm, I'll play a game for like four hours. I'll have three clients in one day. I'll cook, I'll clean in the daytime. I'll go to the gym for like an hour, 20 minutes. And then I'll come home. What's your average amount of sleep and time? ain't enough, like four hours, five okay. hours. Yeah, but well, that's what I'm saying. I She's hate up sleep. vaping. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just by the window. She's up vaping, that's what. <laughs> With the flipping blue light. Because that, that day you just told me, it sounded like it's, it's 11 like, p.m. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And, like 10, 9, 10. Yeah, but man. then I don't. I hate sleep. Like, people actually love sleeping. I hate I sleeping. Sleep. I hate I sleep. I can't get enough of I it. I feel like sleep is a thief. And then you're going to stress out a man like, to the point where you can't. Sleep is a thief. Because what you said, I close my eyes for eight hours and I wake up and I did nothing that whole eight hours. Yeah, I just you have. You did. You allowed get, your body to recover. Now I get mad FOMO. I'm just thinking like. <laughs> what? FOMO? Whilst everyone else is asleep, you get FOMO. Yeah. Like, yeah, you know, just, yeah. Do you know what you need to do? Come I want to seize the day. You want to come off Snapchat? You're I'm si- not on, no, but no, no, no. That's not why, like, She's on a car I'll just be DM. thinking about, like, something I could have done. Like, I'll go for a walk or Vape. something. At night time, like, someone said to me, yeah, obviously I go on walks at night all the time and sometimes people see me on the road and they'll, like, they'll message my ex saying, you know, I saw the... And I'm literally just walking with my... You know, my headphones oh, are weird. big. Yeah, so I'm yeah. just in my own universe. The late at night. And they'll be like, yeah, late at night. Yeah, what no, do you mean, don't do that? Just I'm the mad one on the street at night time, please. <laughs> Anyway, yeah, like, I'll be just doing my own thing at night time and people are just like, do you know, like, that's weird. Like, you're a weirdo. And I'm just like, I don't even, I don't want to go home and sleep. Like, I just don't. That's mm. crazy. I don't. Though. That's why if you don't sleep too much, though, because later on, at the time you get to, like, 40s, you might actually start getting Jundis. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here we are. We're back with right, the Jundis. Can, <laughs> can I say just something? How when long you go on this walk, at least FaceTime you? somebody. FaceTime, Rico, FaceTime on uh, this real... No, this she can't even do that real real. because of people, them not teeth in the phones. It's oh, long. yeah, there's guys going past on bikes. You know two girls I was chatting to over the past year have had their phone snatched, like... I've had on, it before on, as well. On so you oh, saw? my yeah. God. I it's hope nuts. my friend don't hate me for saying this, yeah? Obviously, I'm going to say who it is. No, my friend... She was... She was in the area and a boy drove past her snatched her phone out of her hand and boxed her no <gasps> way please tell <laughs> wait see man them are doing things with two hands <laughs> did he the, the, one snatch one <laughs> bag Fam, what's wrong how these man That's so ambidextrous I don't know wait, what, what word is that ambidextrous he's been able to use two limbs as in like, got he's no just peddling yeah, you got no weak handle no, no weak, weak hand foot. no weak I'm telling you, he, yeah, he took her phone and boxed. Girl, he could have just took the Cost phone and gone, you know. Yeah, he just felt crazy. like I have to violate as well. Like this, this yeah. transaction isn't complete this is until why I you violate need to you. Punch up people, you know. Like, Sometimes no. violence is the I answer, call, and it's and crazy. Got help, like. I've what? actually never had sure. anything stolen. Have you ever been robbed before? Yeah, they took my phone as well. <gasps> And I've I was on never, FaceTime. Ever, 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 ever. And I thank Actually, God. I and it was so out. annoying as well. Like, they snatched AirPod Maxes as well. Yeah, they <laughs> took my phone. Oh, and I was fuming because I was in fresh Air Forces as well. So imagine trying to what run. Is, in, what is, what is, yeah, oh, because oh, oh, imagine okay, trying okay, no, to chase it, 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 in fresh forces. Oh, you tried yeah. to chase? No, you got to give up. From yeah. The, yeah, you just got to let them take it. From time, like, they're in on a mode of transport. Unless it's a bicycle. Bicycle's horror. Like, yeah. you ain't really getting far enough. Now, if someone Bike, robs you. car, don't do any chasing. Yeah, if someone tries to rob you, just let them rob you. They even fight back. Oh, no, but sometimes, my, my foot, friend, she could a, track her Grab phone. the hood, bow, slap on yeah, the I floor. I ain't even fighting back, so I'm letting them Are you not? Gara, gara. Because sometimes I'm you see the fight on my iPhone. You know, too. one time I lost my AirPods in Hyatt. Never. I stop going high. Hey, I stop going high. This is like a year ago, so beginning of the year. I don't go high no more. I don't go high no more. Too many uncles now. But I went high and I lost my AirPods there. Like no one took it from me. I literally I left it on the seat. These ones, yeah. No, no, like small ones. Small ones, okay. And I left them in high when I was drunk as fuck. And then I saw that someone was taking them home. So (laughs) in the morning. I went to the location Good. and I li- I was putting notes through people's letterbox. If you have my if you have my AirPods, I'll give you fifty pound right now because if I block them, you can't use them. Do you get it? So yeah. just give it back. Like I said, I'll give you a, give I'll give you a pinky if you give back my AirPods. Like mm. because really and truly, you were living without AirPods before. That means you don't even want them. You probably want to sell them or something. Like yeah, this is yeah. how much you're probably gonna get. Gonna go try sell them anyway. So just See, give me back there. I like that. I was putting notes, people's airdropping people, knocking on doors. I went like I was just thinking, give me back my shit, give me back my shit. Like I just yeah, want it back. What did you get it back for? <laughs> no, everyone was moving <laughs> so you in shock. Yeah, for nothing. <laughs> 
think, and I could see the location on my phone. Even Printed out paper. Yes, you can but still now see where that it's not. Are. Before, yes, I can. But before, it was in like East London somewhere. But now man, there's one AirPod in Woolworth Road, and the next AirPod in Peckham. So yeah, you, you're sharing the one. AirPod. I think love. he lost it. He probably <laughs> lost it. Yeah, he's doing one one air. He's a broke. He's cooked. Mm. What did you want to say no, about the, the, the dating? Because oh, like, I made a comment, and then because we've only got a, yeah, just. I just wanted to briefly touch on the dating scene right now. Obviously, I wanted to see. What I don't. Use also, but I, I, I don't really have it. I'm not really I dating. Tell, I don't really I can, have I think, one. I think I think I we've know. all had a bit of a horror Actually, year with dating. Do you know what? Can I tell you why? Hinge. Wow. Yeah. Do you know that's what I was gonna say? Oh, I'm, I'm, I know we've all been on Hinge in the last year. My friend mate sent me this Hinge thing, and I was like, "Can I put it up? Can I?" I didn't even put it up. The man didn't waste, no, oh, I can't even find it. The man didn't waste no time. He must have said to my friend, hi, how are you? Oh, I'm good, thank you. How are you? Oh, I'm good. Oh, do you give head all that? Or you're not <laughs> oh, really on that? Fuck off, on Hinge. On Hinge. That's crazy. The first no, that, thing. Do you know what? That's not crazy. That's not crazy. Treacherous. Somebody messaged me and said, what? Can you lift me? Like, Amen. Can... Yes, period. Go on, like, I, don't, I don't think that's a bit forward, that's, that, though. That's a, that's a, that's a, that's that's a, that's a box that, not a bit that you need to no. take. <laughs> well, if I, to me, I like lift the women, but like, that, is that not just a forward thing to just no. ask? That's a bit forward. Was like, it the first thing she said? The first, she reacted to one of my things in the gym and said, what, can you lift me? Said, yeah, what's wrong with that? That's a bit, that's like, okay, that, if that a woman, no, wait, no listen, just, look, let me look at this the same way, yeah? Cool. I don't use gym to sexualize myself. However, How do you know that she was sexualizing you? She could be imagining your wedding and you have to lift her up when you're going when you're but going to I'm your saying, honeymoon. Then, you know how women get the what's the, the lip injection thing? So if if if, if, if say I'm gonna apply it the same way, yeah? yeah. If you can use me going to a place where I work out, I'm probably just relieving stress and you know what I'm saying, like kind of keep myself in shape, okay. yeah. Women get their what's it called? The lip filler or they're looking after their lips, or whatever. I can say, rah, what can you up me with them? It's, it's no, the same but, way I can use that to kind of no, turn but, it into a sexual thing. Do you know what I'm saying? No, but that's how you took it, that she was sexualizing you. She could have genuinely just be asking, can you pick me up? Some girls no, like she... to be picked up sideways. It doesn't have to be in missionary. Like, that, she <laughs> she might not have been talking about that. She it's, might. It's calm. I said Gara. Yeah, I can anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I said, of course I can. You're wild up. I, I don't think... aim at nobody. I can't lift up, I'll be honest. No. Like, but... I'm just lift up supreme still. So, you know what I mean? He's but... taking bare clips My of DMs, me lifting up. They're stupid. Like... When, I, when an ugly person messages me, I just say something absurd. <laughs> Recently, I've got to show you the same But girls are ugly niggas now, no? No. But <laughs> recently, one guy was trying to message me and I was I just I just thought, you're taking a piss. Mm. I replied to him and I said, I heard you do coke. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> He's like, what? That's good, you know. I just didn't respond after. I know his head was spinning. I heard like, you do this. Every time yeah. you piss me, I'm like, no, I heard, I you, heard you do this. I heard you do this. Like, I know his head was spinning. He ain't <laughs> messaging me again. So good. <laughs> That was actually good. Yeah, I was full. Yeah, I, you I imagine your head again. would be mad. Crazy. Crazy. It's crazy. It is crazy. Like, I want you to think I'm crazy. Like, you got to duck out from here, man. So to conclude, the dating scene's a mess. I heard people are running to, like, date as well, which is cold. I'll do that. Yeah. Running to dates? Yeah, running clubs. Oh, oh yeah. I've heard that's new. But you see how now that's now the new thing. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be full of trash people yeah, again. Yeah. So just Pilates women over 5K runners. Though. Gara, gara, gara. I, I need to jump on Pilates. I need to get At one point. It's, it's better. I can't run, guys. Young flexi. I'm not good runner. Anyways, but guys. Yeah, this has been the return of For The Streets, man. That's actually... Finally, let's get, finally let's get a round of applause. Finally, finally happened. Glad it that happened. You know, we've got these two lovely ladies. Give them a round of applause again. Good. Um, not only me, fair enough. <laughs> um, no, but we're happy to have you ladies um, on the on the team. Obviously, the, the streets will start roaming again for us. The place to come to. Um, find us everywhere. Their socials will be there. Our socials will be here. And yeah, like... And yeah, you're going to see us throughout this whole summer, through the winter. Mm. Every not season. only on the pod. Things everywhere. outdoors. Things indoors. Thanks, and then obviously, stuff. Love Island's coming, so check out Tavana stuff soon. Mm. Obviously, if you are into gaming, check out Delicia stuff. Mm. If you like black men, just look, look at me and RMJ and we're there. Tranquil. And then obviously, shout out to Tranquil. Yeah, big up Tranquil. Um, big up Tranquil. This yes. is the jumper. Go yes, on, um, Tranquil. Yeah, we'll, we'll put that in the bio as well. For people listening as well, um, we'll put that in the Spotify, um, Apple Music and whatnot. Um, but yeah, this has been For The Streets. This is Rico. RMJ. Tavana. And Della. And... See you next week, guys. See you. Yeah, man. Bye. Bye. <laughs>